Hey guys, it's Natural Beauty 4554. Hey guys, so we're going to be doing a freshman year dorm room beauty essentials today. Hope you guys like it. Hey guys, so this first part we're going to be doing is going to be all about face stuff you should be bringing for um, your face. And the first thing I want to talk about is definitely your face wash. I use Cetaphil Gentle um, Daily Face Wash. Um, I don't use it every day, but I do use it quite a lot whenever I feel like my face is getting a little bit dirty or I just feel like I need to wash my face, I use that. Um, the next thing I want to talk about is eye and face makeup remover. I use liquid and like a liquid makeup remover and I just use a um, cotton ball or just anything I have on hand to wipe it off. Um, makeup. Now, these are all the things that I use or some of the things that I use but I also think that everybody should have in their makeup bag or things like that. So foundation, mascara, eyeliner, eye lip and face primers, um, eyeshadows, lip gloss, lipsticks. I'm more of a fan of lipsticks than I am of lip glosses. Um, blush, setting powders, concealer, lip liners, brow fillers, and bronzers. I've actually just gotten into filling in my eyebrows and I really, really do love it. I feel like it pulls the look together and I use it all the time. Um, next thing I want to say is everyday lotion. I use a hobo oil. I use like a drop or two and spit on my face because it's very similar to the oils that are already produced on your face. Um, you're going to want to use toner or estrogen. I don't always use those but I know some people do. Acne spot treatment, I have some just in case. A face mask, I have a um, mud face mask by Queen Helene, I really like it. Tweezers, I can only use tweezer man, they're the only tweezers that work for me. I don't know what works for you, but they work perfect for me. And I say drink lots and lots of water because it always is so good for your body and so good for your skin. And that's all I have to say for face. Okay, um, so the next like section of stuff I'm going to talk about is for your hair. Um, now, I don't have a lot of things for my hair, but these are just things I feel like a lot of people should be using um, when they go away to school because, I mean, you're not going to be home and you're going to want to have everything, not everything in bulk, but just like have a lot of things so that you won't have to be going to the store all the time or asking your parents for money all the time, stuff like that. So I want to come prepared. Um, so when I first go to school, I buy pretty much new everything, so I'll be dealing with it while I'm there. So with conditioner and shampoos, um, I'm more into the organics line, and I just started using the Brazilian Keratin Treatment um, Shampoo and Conditioner, and I really, really do like it. Um, then I use oils, like natural oils for my hair, like mostly my ends, because um, I do straighten my hair a lot, so it gets very dry. So I use grapeseed oil olive oil, jojoba oil, coconut oil is very very good for moisturizing the hair. It gets absorbed just like your seed oil does rather than sitting on your hair. Um, rosemary oil more, mostly on my scalp just to stimulate my follicles to help my hair grow. Moroccan argan oil which is very good and tea tree oil which is just a natural antiseptic and it's just very good for everything. <laughs> um, I use a straightener all the time. Uh, so you want to have one of those, a heat protectant, because I do never, I never use my um, straightener without a heat protectant. I use IC Fantasia and Brazilian Keratin Spray as a heat protectant. Um, a curling iron, I don't have one, but most people do. Rubber bands, headbands, and you have to rock awesome styles for hair. I braid my hair a lot, or put braids in my hair and little things like that to help me um, not have the same hairstyle every day. So I hope this part helped you guys a lot. Hair. Hey guys, so I'm going to be doing the next beauty section on your body or like things you'll need for your entire body mostly. Um, so the first thing I want to talk about is body wash. Um, I use it every single time I take a shower every day so I like to use moisturizing body wash rather than something that will it will make me clean, but it will also moisturize my skin with different vitamins, like vitamin E, A, and D, and things like that. Um, I also have a body scrub to get off all the dead skin. Um, I use it two or three times a week. Um, I also use body lotion every single day. 
whenever I feel like my skin is very dry or whenever I feel like um, I need it on my hands because my hands do get very dry and also whenever I get out of the shower. And I use Clean Helene's um, Cocoa Butter Hand and Body Lotion. I just started using it and it's pretty good. Um, also, you all should get some feminine wash. I use Summer's Eve. It's always good to have in your shower, always good to have in your drawer just in case. Um, but I do use it every time I take a shower. I feel like it's necessary ever since I started. Um, razors for, I mean, your legs. I mean, everything. Anything you take. I mean, it's a body essential for me. Um, nail clippers because my nails grow super, super fast on my toes and my hands. So I definitely need that all the time. Um, also nail polishes. Like, me and my friends love to have nights where we just, like, watch movies chill out in our dorm rooms and bring a bunch of nail polishes and do the craziest nail colors like five different colors on one nail and it's really really fun a good way to bond or find new friends in school as this will be your first year so I hope you guys really enjoyed the video I hope you get a lot of good tips from this and I'll be making it another video soon see you guys later so I hope you guys can rate comment and subscribe bye